Here's the bell tower, and this is the nice park area around it. There's kind of a local feel here. People can hang out and just do whatever. Couples, people resting, people just walking. Big hotel on the side. It's a nice area. And then of course on the other side is the famous bell tower, which I will be going to tonight. Because it's open late. Right now hopefully I'll be able to get to the south wall and rent a bike and ride around the, the whole extent of the city walls. Alright. Ah yes, and a very cool fountain. Here is uh, kind of the square next to the bell tower. Very nice flower design. And of course, the omnipresent Starbucks, where you can buy extremely mediocre coffee for extremely high prices. And Hagen Das, where you can buy pretty good ice cream for insane prices. This is a little side street that leads to that market area I just video. This place is kind of cool because uh, last night there was a really, really good kid playing guitar and singing. It's just an idea of the area. Here we are at the bell tower, it's nighttime. I was gonna wait until it was darker and then I realized that we're in a city, the city doesn't get darker. So here's a view of the city at night. Very, very bright spotlight under us to help illuminate the pagoda at night. The bell tower. As you can see, it's still very busy, partly because it's main tourist place and also partly because it's Golden Week, which means everyone in China is on vacation. There's a bell. Again, you can ring it for an insane amount of money, or you can just look at it. Or you can wait for one of a billion tourists to ring it. It's been ringing all day. So the bell was to show it was morning. It was dawn, I should say. Here's a woman collecting a large wad of cash. People pay money for that for some reason. Empty back here. I guess everyone wants to be around front for some reason. It's more of the city center. The city basically functions around the bell tower. This is a uh, roundabout. You actually have to go under the roundabout and come up in the middle um, to get to the tower. And the roundabout itself actually has a human roundabout underneath that's always packed and always chaotic. Uh, so yeah, bell tower, some more video further up. This is the 
12 calendar animals. Here's mine, the pig looking particularly ridiculous. And here's the description of what these are. I don't know if you can even read it. If you can, feel free to pause it. Basically it talks about how these are a special, uh, special craft of uh, Hongxiang County and how they're made with a mix of clay and glutinous rice and pulp and things like that. Here are the Olympic figurines done in this style. Here will be a performance using those bells. Don't know if I'm going to stay yet. Here's a guy playing this flute thing he's trying to sell. He played a stirring edition of Jingle Bells moments ago. It was really great. Desk Tiger. Desk Tiger. A mascot to exercise evil spirits away. Interesting. Tiger for your desk.